Hello YouTube community, my name is Christian and here we are again with another video about watches. In this case we have another digital watch from the brand Citizen and you can see this is an old Citizen watch from 1980. It has a um, multi-alarm watch with full calendar, two alarms, stopwatch and uh, tracking. And I want to show you this watch because um, it's not just an interesting watch with some rare thing like a crown in a digital watch. Uh, because I want to show you because I have another watch of this time. So first, uh, I want to show you some very interesting features. I want to make another video of this watch in the future, but just a little review. As you can see, it has the date, calendar, it has two alarms and the interesting thing, full calendar, it has two alarms, so another alarm, and, uh, another time city of the world, in this case Paris, stopwatch and a tracking mode, I want to start this one while we are recording. So, look at this, it has two alarms, but it's very interesting because the two alarms have different uh, frequencies, so the, the sound is quite different. It's not just the classic big big, it's like a little bus, you know? And you can see here the symbols, they are different. So, I wanna show you how it sounds in 30 seconds uh, by the way this is a watch from 1980s old Japanese watch stainless steel bracelet and case original from Citizen with the Citizen Quartz logo on it uh, well trust me there is this inscription from Citizen uh, here here the bus It's quite interesting, it's not just a beep. So, uh, in another video I wanna talk more about this watch, the model 940. But at this time I wanna make a quick, a quick video because it happens that I have another watch. The same watch, but I'm gonna open the case and um, it's quite interesting because you can open the case from the back plate and from the upside of the watch. You can remove the crystal with a little notch here. I don't know if you can see it. So with the screwdriver you can open it up. That's right, a flat screwdriver. Be careful. So the idea of this watch is that if you want to remove the battery, you open the back plate. By the way, it's not a screw back plate. These holes, they are just for the buzzing of, buzzing of, the, um, of the alarm with some kind of little spring that moves and produce sound. So this little holes, the idea for this little holes is to make uh, the sound hearable. So, this is a pop-up plate, back plate. So if you want to remove the battery, you take out this plate. And if you want to remove the model, you have to open the, the top plate, the crystal, remove the crystal and take the crown apart so you can remove the, the model. So let's go to the another watch. I'm going to fix this watch because I've broken the crown, the crown steam, steam, I think it's the name. So uh, I have to fulfill my duty to um, take, make this watch function again. So first we're going to open the back plate so you can see the model from the back. I'm going to try to move it a bit so you can read inscriptions on this scene, plastic, it says 940 
O A Citizen Watch Company, I think. No shoes, no shoes, Japan. And another numbers, inscriptions, I think it says an unjustice, and a number, I don't know what it means. Um, here we have another inscriptions referring to the springs. I don't know if you can see it, but it should be a spring here. I have it separately in a secure place right now. So the spring moves and hits the back plate to make the sound. I've, I've removed the battery because I'm gonna fix it. And the idea is to show you that you can open the back plate of the watch. And here it is. So the idea is if you wanna, if you need to remove the model, you need to open the top plate um, with a punch in one of these holes. So you push a punch in one of these holes so you can take apart the, the crown and then remove the battery, the, the model. So it's not just a very interesting watch because it's digital with the crown and two alarms with different sound but how it's made is quite interesting because I've never heard about a watch that you have to remove a top plate. Uh, that's very interesting, that's very dangerous too because you have uh, another surface to, to care about water, um, dust and whatever, any kind of liquid. The previous owner uh, tried to glue it, but if you glue this plate and then you need to remove the model, you're in trouble. Uh, so be careful about that. So I don't recommend you to post this watch to rain or any splash or nothing liquid. Um, take care of it. So hope you enjoyed this video people. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, hit the like button and then um, hit the little bell so you can receive more notifications about my videos. Um, don't forget to leave your comments. Tell me if you any if you wanna um, watch a video about this watch. I have the original manual of this watch with all the instructions, not just for how to operate and all the functions it has to to the user guide. I have this kind of mat manual. For the, for the technical manual, as you can see, with the blow up uh, draws and a lot of very interesting advices for the technical uh, information of the watch. So, if you want to see another video about this watch, don't forget to subscribe and hit the like button and leave your comment. See you!